These are 3D printed rotational flexural bearings. Um, they allow rotation but not translation. So if you need to affix things such that they can only rotate, um, these can be printed in a single piece. They are a single piece. Um, and the angle here is so that it requires, it has no overhangs. You can just print them straight like this. And they have a number of advantages, like there's no play at all. And the main disadvantage is, of course, that they have a limited degree of motion. But for some tasks, like say um, you had like a mirror on this and you're doing like a laser uh, pointing thing, or maybe for a balance wheel for a clock, or the various other things, and that's perfectly acceptable. And the fact that they have no play and it's fully 3D printed, um, and they are perfectly silent, um, means we could probably find some uses. Um, another thing would be like compliant mechanisms. So for instance, if you had something, a mechanical thing where like humans would interact with it and you want to make sure um, like they stick their hands in it, it's not going to crush them. Like if you put these in your arms, it, it will limit the max amount of force you can do. And this one is printed out of uh, Polylite, uh, Polymaker Polylite PLA. Um, and uh, it has 60 degrees of motion, and this one is printed out of, um, I believe, Hatchbox Pro PLA. And uh, it was going for 90 degrees of motion before it hits the end stop, but it doesn't quite make it there. So um, with PLA, at least, um, you're limited to about, um, yeah, I, I would say like 70 degrees or 80. However, there's lots of other materials you can print with, and certainly um, PLA is one of the stiffest. So... Um, if we're to use like uh, polypropylene, I'm sure you can get like maybe even up to 120 degrees. Um, and you can always stack them if you need more range. And so, I don't know, it'd be kind of neat to make like a robot arm or something that uses this um, to make things fully printable in one piece. And of course you can make it, if you have the ability to print with support, you can um, straighten these and make it a lot more compact or more pancake-like. So, there you go. Um, and, yeah, I'm putting a lot of pressure on this, and it's not even budging. Yet, yeah, still rotates freely.